screen mirroring your techno phone or any Chinese branded smartphone to your TV. Completely free, it's wireless, you can see it. There's absolutely no lag. You can even use your camera if you want to. So let me just open up a camera and take a photo off my computer right there. I'm just gonna open up the photo and you can zoom in and you can actually go full screen as well. So I'm just gonna rotate the phone. You can see it, I'm gonna zoom in. You can see my computer, pretty decent wallpaper. I mean, I built that myself, by the way, I built that. <laughs> Yeah, pretty awesome, right? Completely free. You don't have to download anything on your phone. Everything is built into it. So, so let's just dive right into it. Hey, what is going on, everybody? I'm Riz, and welcome to another awesome, awesome video. Today's video, I've got a Techno Gammon 30. I mean, it looks pretty cool, by the way. So today's video, it's all about screen mirroring and connecting your Chinese branded smartphone to your TV completely free. And it doesn't matter if you have a Techno, it doesn't matter what... Chinese branded Android phone you have, it will work with literally anything you have. So comment down below what Chinese branded phone you're using and it looks pretty cool. I mean, I've never seen phone like this. I mean, it looks pretty cool. Usually I'm stuck with Samsung and iPhones, but this is kind of new actually. Oh, and by the way, before we jump into the video, a lot of you guys are not subscribed to the channel who watch these videos, so please be sure to subscribe. It's gonna help the channel a lot. Now let's just dive right into it. All right, so the, there's one thing we need to do before we actually jump into the video. So the first thing you wanna do on your Techno or any Android phone that you have, is to go into your settings page. So let me just go into the settings page. All right, so into the settings page, go to your Wi-Fi settings. Now this is really, really important. So to mirror the Android phone to your TV, we need to make sure that there is a connection in between. So in this case, I'm just gonna use my home Wi-Fi. Click enable and it will automatically connect it to my home Wi-Fi. But let's just say if you don't have home Wi-Fi, you can go into the hotspot settings and you can enable your personal hotspot. I would not recommend this because this will cost you data plans. If you have a credit in your SIM card, they will all actually this will use that credit to enable a high enable a Wi-Fi kind of environment. So I would not recommend it. Use your home Wi-Fi. It's completely free. It's homey and everything is just it's there, you know, you don't have to worry about data plans or anything like that. So once your phone is connected to your TV, that is pretty much all we have to do. Now we need to do the exact same thing onto your TV. So let's just do that. First thing you want to do on your TV is to make sure your TV is connected to the exact same Wi-Fi as your Android phone is connected to. So in this case, I have connected my Android phone to my home Wi-Fi. You just saw it. We just did that. And we have to make sure the TV is also on the exact same Wi-Fi as our phone is. So let's do that. Okay, so go to your menu settings. This might look different by the way, so but settings are pretty much the same. Go to your general settings. You might have to find the network settings. So it might not be in general, but it should be somewhere into the settings. So go to your network settings. Now, if you have done this before, you can just click on network status. It will automatically connect your TV to the Wi-Fi. Or if you have never done this before, go to your open network settings click on wireless and all the connections will be available to you. So in this case, as you can see right there, I've got a couple of connections right there. First one is gonna be my home Wi-Fi. Second is actually a hotspot coming up from a Huawei device. Go click on home Wi-Fi and it's pretty much connected. By the way, I would recommend you use your home Wi-Fi. You don't have to use any hotspot or anything else. Home Wi-Fi is free, it's homey and you don't have to worry about any data plans or anything like that. So. Once your TV is connected, you, you don't have to do anything else. Literally nothing else you have to do. So I got the Android phone, or in this case, Kemen 30. Any Android phone about, we're, 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 <laughs> any Android phone will work, okay? So don't worry about that. Okay, so now what you wanna do is to go into the settings. All right, so once you're into the settings, these settings can be confusing on these Android smartphones. I've never used anything like this before, so it's kind of difficult, but it's okay. So. I'm gonna guide you through it, don't worry about it. So into the settings, go and find something called connection and hotspot. I don't know why it's called hotspot and connection, but it should be something like connection settings, like more connection settings or connection and hotspot settings. In this case, it's actually hotspot and connection settings. Okay, so into the hotspot and connection settings, go all the way down until you find something called cast or wireless or screen mirroring. In this case, it's called cast, so I'm just gonna click on that. As you can see, cast is turned off. I'm just gonna enable that right there. See, once it's enabled, it will automatically search or look for the TVs that are running on the exact same home Wi-Fi. So in this case, I've got a Samsung TV. That's the that's the one that's running in the background. The second TV, I have no idea about. The third, honestly, I think it's from the second room. 
still no idea. So I'm just gonna click on my TV, just gonna click on that. And it's connecting, you can see it's asking for permission on your TV and it says Techno Kemen 30 as well. So what I'm gonna do is just gonna click allow. So let's do that. Oh, I've got the remote right, remote right here. So you can see right there. So I'm just gonna click, wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna click okay. As you can see, it's right there. Techno Kemen 30, let's, let's see. I hope it's connected. Oh, right there, see? Oh, we're connected. Pretty awesome, right? I mean, it's completely free. It's lag free as well, but I've never done this before on this smartphone. So I'm just gonna open up a camera just to show you how smooth this is. Let me just take a photo. This actually takes pretty decent photos, honestly. <laughs> you know, I didn't like the sound, by the way. Um, let me just zoom in, see? And by the way, if you wanna go full screen, you can. I'm just gonna disable the auto disable the uh, rotate option. I'm just gonna enable the rotate option right there. And you can see it, it should go full screen right there, see? And if you zoom in, if you zoom in, it's gonna go full screen as well. And if you zoom in, you can see it's gonna go full screen. Oh, by the way, you can see my phone right there. I mean, let me just zoom in. Oh, it's pretty zooming in pretty good. So as, you, as I just said before, I've used, I'm using iPhone and a Samsung Galaxy Fold 6 at the moment, but I've never, done, I've, never, never, I've never done this before. I've never done anything like this on something like this before. I mean, it looks pretty cool. The Android, it looks pretty clunky to me, but, but it's smooth, it's lag free, and you can do tons on this. You can watch videos if you want to. So let me just open up YouTube and open YouTube. You can see it's actually working pretty flawlessly. So I'm just gonna click on one of the video. The audio is coming from the... The audio is coming from the uh, TV. It's pretty amazing. So I'm just gonna close this. But just to give you an idea, it's absolutely awesome. So the way you stop this is really simple as well. If you look at the top right, if you look at the top corner, you can see that my phone is being screen mirrored to right now, see? So what I'm gonna do is go to the settings. Go to the settings again, go to the connection settings again. Go all the way down until you find this cast. You can just click on disable and it will automatically disable on your TV. So I'm just gonna click on disable and you can see it, it has disabled on my TV. So if I have to do this, if you wanna do this again, you just have to click on cast, enable the cast. You can click on wireless display. It might take a couple of seconds, by the way, you can see right there, I just disconnected it. So it will take a couple of seconds right there. It's available now. I'm just gonna click on it and as you can see, you don't need the uh, permission again and it will automatically connect to your TV. It's pretty amazing. So let me just click okay, click home. There you go. Pretty awesome, right? Well, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you liked it. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out. All right, so that's pretty much it for the video. Got a Techno Kamen. That was pretty awesome, right? Comment down below what Chinese branded phone you have. I got a Techno Kamen, which I'll comment down below as well. So be sure to comment down below. Again, if you have any questions, do let me know in the comment section below. I will definitely, definitely get back to you, okay? I mean, I get back to all my subscribers, so be sure to subscribe, right? <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you liked this video and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.